Tell me about this one. The librarian pointed at the bright yellow and orange on the blue background of my sketchbook. It was late in the nearly empty library, and I'd stopped to thank the librarian for pointing me to the huge collection of art books on the eighth floor. To explain my love of art books, I pulled out my own little five by eight inch watercolor pad. She loved the fruit. So I told her the story. It was a winter visit to Niagara. So cold the falling water had frozen into big monoliths. Dark came early and I gave up on the icy scenery to paint a still life at the B&B. But where to start? The table runner had more flowers than the bowl high had fruit. The eye naturally goes to where the lightest light meets the darkest dark, so the tablecloth practically screamed for attention. But color also has a way of grabbing the limelight, or should I say, the lemon light. So the larger mass of the combined bright orange and that juicy yellow lemon were shouting, look at me, look at me. So it comes down to balance. See that one solid dark blue inside the rim? I pointed to the spot where the librarian was looking. It's a rest for the eyes, but also a pointer. The curve leads your eyes to the bright fruit. Captivated by the eye-catching color, my new librarian friend pulled out more stories from my sketchbook which reminded me to share them with you. Hope you enjoyed this glimpse into fruit and flowers and the process of painting. So when life hands you a bowl of lemons, make art! I'm Kathy Hagen at kathyhaganartist.com. See you there.